So in this video, I'm trying to film here in the studio and trade, and sometimes life gets in the way. Check out this lesson. What's up, Tim Sykes, millionaire mentor and trader here, filming in a studio here in LA. I don't know, can they, can you like move the camera so they can see the studio? Sure. We got Pasqualito here. Hey Look at this little studio we got. So I'm filming this studio, um, but the stock market is also open and we have the studio just for a little bit of time. So I'm like trying to manage filming because I want to make you guys more videos. Leave some comments below. Do you want more videos? Um, also click like and click subscribe if you want me to keep doing these free videos. I don't have to do that, remember? I've got a whole premium uh, video um, section which is for the most dedicated students, but I like doing these too. Let me know if you like it. So I'm trying to manage these videos, trying to trade. There's a little couch over there um, and I haven't eaten lunch yet. Pasqualito is gonna go get lunch. How far is lunch? Three, four minutes. Oh, starving. Um, so trying to manage a lot. And I think this is a good lesson for you because we all have busy lives, most of us. Some of us are just losers and you have no life whatsoever. But most of us have busy lives, one reason or another, um, family, kids, school, filming in studios, different time zones. So it's like, how do you make trades while this is happening? So I want Pasqualito, not just to get the lunch in a second, but also to pull up this chart of AABB. Uh, this is a former supernova. This is one of the biggest runners of 2021. They have this gold-backed crypto. It's a pretty easy story to tell, you know, gold-backed crypto. Who knows if it's gonna work or not? But I've underestimated it many times before in the past. Um, profited, but really went further than I thought. Kind of trades a little weird, but at least now I've traded it like a dozen times. I've won more than I lost. And today, we were filming videos and, you know, I'm in LA right now, the stock market closes at 1 p.m. Eastern, so I'm trying to time videos and not trade. So it was around like 12 p.m. Uh, LA time, which is 3 p.m. Eastern. Uh, AABB has a first green day today. Looks like it can keep going, but I'm not sure. Usually on a first green day OTC pattern, I'm gonna buy it around 3.30, 3.40, 3.45 p.m. Eastern just because I wanna see if it's closing strong. So at 3 p.m., it was around 20 cents a share. It was uptrending on the day, but it hadn't really broken out. I was like, it's okay, Pasqualito, let's get like a video in. So I do a video, one of these you know, videos, and I go down and I run to this sofa and I, I yell at Pasqualito and I say, damn it, Pasqualito, the thing broke out. Cause it broke out from 20, not huge, but 20 to 21 and I miss like a penny a share. I hate missing that uh, breakout. It's not even about the penny a share. I mean, I bought roughly 50,000 shares at 21.3. Um, could have gotten that at 20.3. So missed out on like 500 bucks there. But more important than the money, because I donate all my trading profits to charity, I want to be there when a stock breaks out. And Pasqualito heard me yell. You heard me yell, right? 100%. I, I hate missing breakouts. Is the food here? All right, good. At least the food's gonna make me happy. The good news is Pasqualito also has this intraday chart of AABB, so you can see it actually closed uh, near 23, so it kept going just the first green day. Um, if you click the link below, we're gonna link um, a blog post about the first green day with OTC plays. Former supernovas with volume, with a percent gain. Right now, today, the market's not doing very well. The NASDAQ was down pretty big. So for this to be up in a down market, crypto was also down. Um, it shows some relative strength. And again, you have the gold back crypto story launching in a few days. I think we're like seven days away from the public launch. So again, I'm not investing in this company long term, but first green day on OTCs. Why does that work? If you click the link, you can see a detailed blog post. But long story short, OTCs don't trade pre-market. So everyone who sees AABB, I'm sure the promoters are gonna talk about gold back crypto. Um, people are gonna see it on scans as a big percent gainer. They're gonna see it as a first green day. Anybody who sees it between now and when the market opens tomorrow at 9.30 a.m. Eastern, 6.30 a.m. LA time, not fun for me here. Um, they're gonna say, wow, I wanna buy it, and they can't buy it pre-market, so all those buy orders pile up at the market open. It's just a little inefficiency, 
but most likely I'll be able to sell it at 24, maybe 25 tomorrow. Remember I got in just over 21, so if I make four cents a share on roughly 50,000 shares, I mean that's a $2,000 profit. Nothing huge, but again, this is what I teach. I love my haters who are like, you and your students are bad for these companies, there's more money, believe in them long term. They all fail long term, okay? I'm sorry, all the most heavily promoted OTC plays fail. Their stocks drop 80, 90, 100% in the long run. I don't care what happens to AABB two years, three years, five years from now. There's a chance, okay? It's not like 100%, it's like 99.99997. So maybe this is the one. I don't care. If I expect failure from this one and all the other ones, and I just focus on my pattern, and I lock in my thousand, I lock in my 2000, it adds up to millions. It's not just me who understands this now. Now I have over two dozen millionaire students. You might not realize it. Depending on how many videos of mine you've watched in the past, you've probably seen me say I have like two, two millionaires, three millionaires, five millionaires, six millionaires. Like about a year, year and a half ago, I had like 10 millionaire students. Now, in the past two years, I've quintupled the number of millionaire students. Due to a hot market, due to, frankly, how many students have been now studying the past, the more you study my video lessons, the more you study my webinars and blog posts, the better your odds of success. So it's preparation meeting opportunity. So this is not that big of a play, um, you know, to, to try to make, uh, you know, 1,000, 2,000, maybe I'll make 3,000, maybe I'll lose. Like it's not a guaranteed profit. But I try to take uh, setups where the odds are in my favor. And more times than not, I've underestimated AABB. More times than not, first green day OTC plays with upcoming catalysts like this keep going. Um, more times than not, I win. And if I lose, I will simply cut losses quickly. If I have to sell at 20 or 20.5 or maybe break even. But if my downside risk is half a penny or maybe a penny a share, do we have lunch? If my downside risk is half a penny or a penny a share and my upside is two, three, four cents a share, that's good. There's more upside than downside. I win more often than I lose. I have the right setup. That's my trade today. I'm gonna go eat lunch, but I hope that you learn. How long is this video, Pascalito? We're good? All right, I gotta go eat, I'm starving. Um, but check out this multi-month chart of AABB. You can see that it's a former runner. It likes to run for multiple days. They have their upcoming product coming in a few days. Um, people are getting excited. I lead by price action and right now I lead by my nose because it smells good. Have a good day.